All right, what is going on, everybody? And welcome to this Madden 21 expansion franchise. As you can see, we are a team called the Bulls, not the Chicago Bulls. No, 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 no. We actually relocated the New York Jets to Brooklyn and became the Brooklyn Bulls. Now, it was between the Brooklyn Bulls, Barons, and some other team. It's useless. I did pick the Bulls, um, and I completely, like, the entire team is different. Like, I, I either traded everyone or just let them walk in free agency. I skipped over the offseason um, because I, don't, I didn't really see a point of doing that. I skipped over the offseason, made all the moves I was going to do. And I'm actually going to show you them right now, if possible. Am I able to show? I think. All right, I cannot show you the actual transaction report from the offseason. But I'll just show you the roster. We got Rodney Huston from the Raiders, I believe. I think we just traded another center for him. We got Marlon Mack, who we signed in free agency. Marcus May, who was already on the Jets. We have um, L... I don't know how to say his first name, to be honest. Jenkins. I forgot. I think we, we got him in a trade. I just forget from where. James Crowder has already been on the team. Quinn Williams, already on the team. We signed Antonio Brown in free agency, so that's a different pickup. I got to change his number back to 84 or something. We signed Canoe Neal and moved him over to free safety. Um, Becton was already on the team. Jay, Jayon Brown, um, I believe we traded for. I don't know if he was on the He might have been on the team already. We signed Robbie Gold. We signed Xavier Rhodes. We signed Nikel Roby Coleman. Um, Franklin Myers, I believe, was on the team. Um, and here is one of the biggest. We signed Philip Rivers. This is going to be his last year in the NFL. If you don't know, I'm a Chargers fan, so I love Philip Rivers. We signed him to a one-year deal, most likely his last year in the NFL. Um, we signed Shaquem Griffin. Um, and then we have other players. And if we go to our rookies, we drafted with the number two pick, Justin Fields. Now, you may be wondering, why won't you draft Trevor Lawrence? Because... I mean, I see everyone, everyone always drafts Trevor Lawrence when they're doing something like this. So I figured, you know what? I'm going to draft Justin Fields. He's a mobile quarterback. Um, he reminds me a little bit of Demar Jackson. Just, I mean, he has like no accuracy, so that needs to be worked on. But we're going to be starting Philip Rivers, so maybe he can mentor him. If we go to the roster and we go to um, the youngest age, you can see the rest of our rookies. We drafted this dude. I'm not going to try Brown. We'll call him Brown. We drafted him based off his speed. We also drafted Jalen Waddle based off his speed. Um, we drafted Dante Stills, who was a 67 overall. These guys are just low overalls. But that's really the team. We fired our entire staff, got brand new staff that auto-generated. And, I mean, there's not much else to, you know, go over. We're just going up against the Indianapolis Colts, who I believe signed Colin Kaepernick. And for this, we're going to be playing offense only. Now, the reason I am doing offense only is because I suck at defense. I literally, I can, in Madden, I cannot play defense in Madden. Same thing with 2K. Can't play defense in 2K either. But we'll take a look at our uniforms before we jump into this game. Um, these are the home uniforms, all navy and gold. I'm not a fan of the font. But other than that, I mean, they're, they're pretty damn decent. And for the away uniforms, they're about the same. Just navy pants, white uniform. And those are literally our own uniforms. <laughs> That's it. I think we're going to go a full navy for our first game. And, I mean, we're going up against the Colts. They're not a very good team now. So, let's just hop into it. Here we go. Our first ever game in the NFL. And we're at home. How did I not realize that? In our new stadium. Going up against the Indianapolis coach. Colts? Or coach? I say Colts. Um, Phil Rivers going up against his former team. He only played one year there. There he is. He's going to have the start in this game. Marlon Mack also going up against his former team. I forgot we signed him. And I forgot he was from the Colts. Uh, you can see Colin Kaepernick, not much else to say. Let's see if we can grab this win against Indy. And our first time on offense, the Colts ended up getting a field goal, leading three zip. We're on the 25-yard line, and we're going to give the ball straight to Marlon Mack, who's wearing number 34. We, we might need to change that. Got two yards on the first carry. Um, Yeah, that's Antonio Brown wearing 87. That's got to change. I forgot to change that. Marlon Mack, second carry of the game. Gets about three more. Third and five here, looking to throw. Let's see what Philip Rivers got left in the tank. He's only a 76 overall, 39 years old at this point. Oh, okay, I did not exp Okay. Not a great first drive as that went for nothing. All right, the Colts went down the field and ended up scoring a touchdown. Looking really good so far in this season. Oh, that's a bad pass. And it connects with Jamison Crowder. Only 14 seconds left in this first quarter. 
We're going to have Jameson Crowder actually streak to the end zone here and see what we can get going. And he's going to get open. Oh, that's bad. It's almost picked off. The safety came last second. Third and one here. I Actually, I'm going to switch it to a run and see what we can do. I'm going to switch it to a run. Marlon Mack, he's not going to get enough. And we don't... I'm going to go for it. Fourth and one. We're an expansion franchise. What, what, what are we going to lose? We're going to run it with Marlon Mack again and see if we can get it. I mean, we don't got much to lose here. Marlon Mack... And he's going to just barely get the first down. All right, we're going to pass again here. See if we can get going. I see Antonio Brown over the middle, and it's deflected. Bad read on my half. All right, second and 10. We're going to run a halfback screen for Marlon Mack. See if we can get any sort of offense. DeForest Buckter was rushing me, and our, did no one got a block there. Well, another third down situation here, third and eight. Gonna go play action here. See what we can do. Over the middle. It's Antonio Brown with the reception. Shotgun formation here for the Bulls. First and 10. Giving up to Marlon Mack. Who's gonna have some running room. And gets the first down. First big run for him this game. Five attempts. 20 yards. I already messed up. Gonna go first and 10 here. We're actually gonna audible to a play action. And see if we can get AB open again. Hopefully our... O-line holds up. AP gets the reception. Touchdown. First touchdown in franchise history goes to Ant Philip Rivers to Antonio Brown. That doesn't sound right, but it is. Antonio Brown gets wide open on the play action and scores. Our defense comes up huge, stopping the Colts as we now have a chance with four minutes left in the second quarter to at least tie it. Marlon Max going to get some room. And he goes down with a six-yard gain. All right, here we go. We're going to pass on this play. And I kind of panicked there. I thought I was getting rushed, but we still get two yards. Third and one. We're actually going to go with toss play here to Marlon Mack and see if we can get anything. Marlon Mack, he's going to stretch. That should be it. That's two yards. First and ten. That's what you like to see. All right, we're going to go deep. Third down. Not third down. First down. Oh, that's bad. Throw it away. Phillip Rivers gets it away. Whew. Now right, we're going to run a cross drag here, second and 10, 250 left in this um, second quarter. See if anyone's going to get open, and he does. St. Brown, the rookie, his first reception of his career. Phil Rivers is looking really nice, 7 for 10, 77 yards, and a touchdown. We're going to run here, actually. They kind of got the box filled, so this could be a bit risky, but we're going to do it. Hoping our O-line holds up, and they kind of do. They got five seconds left to the... Um, two minute warning. And I'm gonna go down. O line. I'm not sure if that was their fault or he just, you know, broke the coverage, but they're gonna get the sack. Third and fifteen now. I wanna get into field goal range. That sack got us out of field goal range, and that's not good. Over the middle, Antonio Brown gets down to the twenty first down. Minute thirty eight to go. We're actually gonna run a halfback screen and see if it'll work this time. Marlon Mack gets open, but there's no one guarding the corner. We're going to run the same play that got AB that first down. Let's see if we can do it again. Antonio Brown's got it. And he's always at the one. I don't know why I called a timeout. We're going to go for a full back dive here. Let's see what we can do. I would go with Marlon Mack, but we need the bigger body. And he's in the end zone. Touchdown. That's actually a tight end playing fullback. But he gets in, and we're going to take... The four-point lead. The Colts end up scoring a touchdown. We got nine seconds left. I'm not going to risk it because... I mean, we, got, we got two timeouts, actually. There's a chance. There's a chance. You know what? We're going to do it. We're going to do it. I see you wide open. Hernan, get out of bounds. He doesn't get out of bounds. We got two seconds left. Two seconds left. We're going to run this post route. See if AB can get open. See if anyone can get open. Uh, AB, downfield. That might be a pick. And it's intercepted. Bad, bad play calling. Should have just ran it. He's not going to return it. He's not going to return it. We get the ball back at halftime, though. That's why I wanted to score so bad. All right, never mind. We actually didn't get the ball back at halftime. And the Colts turned it over. Uh, I, right. Marlon Mack, big run. Oh, it could have been a big run, but 23 got him. Second and inches here. Down by three. Colts got the turnover. And DeForest Buckner is going to go right through our O-line. 
Third and inches. We're gonna no, we're gonna do it. Run it straight through a Marlon Mack. See if we can get anything. And we're gonna get the first down and more. I'm gonna go play action read here. This is a weird, weird positioning. Oh, that's bad pass, and it's picked off again. Bad read on my hand, and that's another pick. And the Colts are going to end up going down the field and scoring a touchdown. I am just making bad, bad reads right now, making Phillip Rivers look really bad. Marlon Mack is going to get some separation. First and 10 here. Trying to redeem myself. There's no one open. Oh, my God. Antonio Brown got stuck in the defender. Madden, you got to be kidding me. Second and 10 here. We can't get anything going now in the passing game. Like, it's just not going well. We're going to have Crowder streak. Oh, okay. We're going to have St. Brown. That was our best option there. Third and three. Let's see if we can get the first down here. We're going to motion Griffin. He's going to go back. Kike the ball, please. Thank you. And I see you down the middle. Antonio Brown dropped it. Fourth and three. You know what? I'm just going to go for it. I'm. I'm. We're, what do we have to lose? We're not a good team. So we ain't got much to lose. Probably should have punted it. No, I should have. Please. Hold. What was that animation, Matt? Oh, my God. That animation honestly just screwed us. Like, that was bull crap. That shouldn't have been the case. There is no one open. I'm. This is not going good. One thing I'm going to have to do is um, change the offensive playbook because whatever one our new coach has is just not it. And 74 just did not want to block on that play. Third and nine. Still not looking good. That first half was really, really good on our end. And I really don't know what happened there. Has Hernan is going to get the reception. Throw another play action and hope someone can get something. Like this offense is not looking great. As Jameson, way overthrown Phillip, way overthrown. Second and 10 now. Phillip Rivers, besides those two picks that were 100% my fault, you're not looking great. I understand you're at 39 years old as the rookie St. Brown is going to get it. These these are very inaccurate passes, Phillip. And we haven't really ran it. I think we ran it like 13 times with Marlon Mack. So, I mean, that could be something. Maybe we, you know, oh my God. Can Jameson Kraut? And he doesn't. But yeah, we might need to incorporate the run game a bit more. As you can see, our offensive breakdown. 14 rushes, 26 passes, down the middle, and it's one-handed picked off. One of my... I know that was a bad read, but he picked off with one hand. I want to see that happen in real life, EA. Show me that happening in real life. And our defense could do nothing to stop the Colts offense. They scored again. Down the middle, I see Crowder. At this point, it's just stat padding, even though Phillips got three interceptions. First and ten now. It's obviously a lost cause, but it's, it's just sad because this game was winnable. Very winnable. Phillip, I don't know how he caught that, but that pass was way off target. First and ten, 237 left. Like I said, we're just stat padding at this point. We are just stat padding. I see Hernan's route is very favorable. E e Philip! Oh my god, I know you're on the run, but Jesus Christ, dude. How are you that inaccurate? Second and ten. Maybe Philip can actually throw an accurate pass this time. Hernan, wide open. He holds on. We're gonna run a slant route here. Let's see. Wide open. It's St. Brown, and he doesn't get to the end zone. We're actually gonna run it here, seeing that the Colts are kind of playing in coverage a bit. Marlon Mack. Gets in the end zone his first touchdown as a bull. Like I said, we're just stat pat. We have three timeouts and two minutes left. There's a chance. And for some reason, they went for two. Actually, I understand why they went for two, but that kind of screwed us. All right, well, I mean, they're playing very, very they're playing man, so. Down the middle, it's going to be picked off. Wow. Picked off for the fourth time. Phillip Rivers, he's going to start next game, but this is a really, really bad, really, really bad start to this franchise. First game, you throw four interceptions, one touchdown, four picks. It doesn't look good at all. Final stats on the game, Colin Kaepernick, 25 for 39, 290 yards and two touchdowns. 
Philip Rivers had a 51 QB rating, 18 for 33, 262 of touchdown and four interceptions. Four. Really, really bad. Aaron Jones played decent. Marlon Mack, in my opinion, played better. He just got less carries. Receiving wise, I, I don't know why it's glitching like this. Antonio Brown, four catches, 96 yards, and a touchdown. He was like, him and Marlon Mack are like the only bright spots in this game. Defensively, uh, who got interception? Jayon Brown got the interception for us defensively. We're 0 1. It ain't looking good. I, I really don't know what else to say. All right, we have a few upgrades here. We got this left. That, that, that. We have our left tackle, Beckton, with an upgrade. Oh, Justin Fields got an upgrade. Why do you have an upgrade? Doesn't matter. Uh, I guess we didn't play downs with him, but it counted. I am going to go for Field General to fix his accuracy because, as we saw in the beginning, his accuracy was very bad. So we get plus two deep accuracy, which is really good. So he goes up to a 74. So that's solid. Apparently, no, even though we didn't play, it counts to his progression of the downs. So that's good. We'll know his, you know, ability soon. And the rest, I'm just going to auto. But we go down in our first game ever, 33-20 to to the Indianapolis Colts. We are going up against the Pittsburgh Steelers next. Do they have Big Ben? They might not have Big Ben, but their defense is very good. Seeing that we're only offense... I'm going to play this game in next episode, so be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you guys are new, and that's going to be for me, GG.